What is going on All People Pokemon? I'm Sam with All People Pokey and today I'm going to be opening up these Pokemon card mystery packs from eBay. They range from the 1999 Wizards of the Coast set right up until modern day sets and I'm pretty excited to get into these. I know uh, there's going to be some secret rares in there and some hollows. I've got a chunky Pikachu to bring me some luck. So let's get into it. So just before we started getting into these awesome cards, I just wanted to go over some of my history with Pokemon. It started for me, the uh, Pokemon obsession, as it did for a lot of people, trading Pokemon cards on the school playground. I think I was around 8 or 9 at the time when I first started hearing about Pokemon and getting into it. I remember that I had a school friend who was a little bit older than me and we were both very into Pokemon. We always used to go to our local shop in the village and buy Wizards of the Coast's uh, cards and I remember the feeling of cracking open a brand new pack it, it's still something that I have as a very fond childhood memory um, and then just seeing how much Pokemon's blown up over the years is just amazing I uh, remember opening these Wizards of the Coast packs with my friend and uh, trading them, saving them. Unfortunately I got rid of uh, a lot of my cards um, many many years ago but then I started playing the uh, the games. Um, my first Pokemon game wasn't this one actually, it was Pokemon Blue from my brother. Um, I've since lent that back to him because uh, he did get that for me. But then when the Game Boy Color came out I got this game, Pokemon Fire Red and it's reignited my my obsession really with Pokemon. Um, I played it for many many years and it sat in the drawer for quite a while but uh, I recently completed another playthrough and it made me want to get back into Pokemon. So uh, let's start opening some of these cards. Do forgive me as well for some of the name pronunciations um, some of the Pokemon I am not familiar with um, just as I'm getting back into it. So uh, let's take a look. Okay, let's get into it. I've got some card sleeves here, hopefully for when we pull something very exciting. Um, but to be honest, with these old Wizards of the Coast packs, I'm just happy to be getting back into Pokemon. Um, I'm fortunate I sold all my Pokemon cards quite a while ago, so uh, I'm just happy to be uh, getting back into it. I thought these would come a little more protected, but hey-ho. The uh, seller did say that these are all Wizards of the Coast for this first pack um, of varying quality from near mint to lightly played. So let's take a look. I'm very excited to be getting into this. Oh, we got Psyduck for our first hit. Now I'm not sure what uh, the quality of these cards is, as I say. Um, they're varying from. Uh, near mint to well played. I mean they don't look too bad, they've got some whitening which uh, is pretty much to be expected. We've got Grimer, we've got Spearow, we've got Jigglypuff, I love the artwork on these, they're so sick. We've got Meowth, we've got Mankey, we've got Rhyhorn, oh we've got Cubone, I love Cubone. Look at that artwork on that. We got Jungle Pikachu. That's not too bad actually. Again, looking uh, looking at the quality. I'll be sleeving that up after the video. We got Golding. We got Parasect. We got Paris. We've got Bell Sprout. We've got Oddish. A Nidoran, a Venonat, an Execute, we've got a Pokeball Trainer card, we've got a Pokedex Trainer card, we've got a Potion Trainer card, and we're back to Psyduck there. Very nice cards there. I'm very pleased with this so far. So we got, oh, we got Diglett, the classic Diglett. Well, there's one here that's uh, protected, so uh, I'm kind of excited to see what that is. We got Ponyta. We got Vulpix. Oh, we got my boy Charmander! 
this was my original starter in uh, the Fire Red game, and uh, I think that's the same for a lot of people. It's a uh, very, very cool, very, very cool Pokemon. Again, there's some whitening on the back, but uh, it's not looking too bad overall. It's love the artwork on that. And then at the bottom, you can see it's all uh, Wizards of the Coast, 1999. We got a Kakuna. We got an Electrode. Interesting. Nice rare there. The car's looking a little beat, but it's exciting. It's exciting to be starting my Pokemon journey again. We've got a Weedle. We've got a Tangler. We've got some energy cards. A switch trainer card, an energy removal, gust of wind, We've got bill trainer card, We've got polywag, we got machoke, nice. Too bad it's not my champ, but hey ho. We got an onyx, we got machop, we got an abra. That's sick. I'd forgotten what this looked like. Got Poliwag, got Star You, we got Horsey, and we're back to Diglett. Okay, I'm very excited to open the next pack because we are guaranteed some rares and some secret rares. Okay, so let's get into this. So, in this pack, this is a pack of 100 Pokemon cards. This will range from the Wizards of the Coast set right up until modern day sets. And as I say, we're guaranteed some rares and some secret rares in this one. Ah, here we go. So these are more packaged. This is what I was expecting more so from the previous seller, but it's no worries. Okay, so we got 50 cards, 50 of each. And uh, as I say, we got some newer ones and some older ones in here. Ooh, that back card is pre-sleeved and it's looking very nice. Let's save that one right to the end, as the seller intended. Nice, so we got a hollow there. So we got a, I believe it's a hollow, a Grama hollow. Very nice. We've got an Alteria. We've got a Copper Adger. We've got a Trainer Battle Pass. we got the Sydney Trainer card. I'm not sure what sets these are from as well, um, but I'm going to be looking this up after the video. We've got a Turbo Patch. We've got Dangerous Drill Trainer card. We've got some energy cards. I believe they're all. Oh, one second. I believe they are all together, the energy cards. Yep. We've got Mr. Mime. We've got Corp Fish. We've got a Frischel. We've got a Crawdon. We've got a more modern star you. Very nice. We've got Slowpoke. We've got Magikarp. We've got a Morpico. Love the artwork on that. Very cool. We got a Rodem. We got Shinx. Ah, oh, I love Shinx. Shinx was one of my team back in the day. We got a Yamper. We got a Pikachu. These are all in very nice quality, these cards. No whitening. I'll be sleeving that up for my partner, as uh, she uh, loves Pikachu cards. We've got a Voltorb. We've got a Scatterbug. Oh, just took one from there. We've got an Eldross. We've got a Blipbug. We've got a Rowlet. A Yanma. Grookey, very nice. Got a Thwacky. Got a Durant. Got a Carvanine. 
we got a Cassini. We got a Paris. We got a Caterpie. A Metapod. A more modern Cubone card. Very cool. I still think I prefer the uh, Wizards of the Coast artwork, but still very cool. We've got a Gligar. We've got a Mindfu. We've got a Trapinch. A Carcoal. A Mankey. A Girl School. Girl School? Yeah. A uh, Rolly Collie. we got a Graveler. We got another Cubone. And we've got our first V card. We've got a Dreadnought V. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. So I'm glad that this is already pre sleeved. Very cool, though. I shall put that. I'll put these over here. And for our first fire hit, I'm going to put that in the corner. Very cool. So let's check out the next 50 cards. Oh, again, we got the last one sleeved. So we got a cast raw, we got a cast form, <laughs> a cast form reverse hollow. We've got an Aaron reverse hollow. We've got a Cursola, a Ribbon Badge, a Spirit Mask, we've got an Aroma Lady Training Card, we've got a Moon and Sun Badge, we've got some more Energies, last one's upside down, Fusion Strike Energy, very cool. Hiding energy. We got a Tootle. Oh, I think a Tootle is my spirit animal. I'm always hungry. We've got a Floatzel. A Snoom. A Coughing. A Gold Bat. I'm loving the artwork on these. A Houndor. Houndor was one of my OG team as well. Very, very cool. We got a Murkrow. We've got a Nicket. We've got a Spinarak. Another Coffin card. Another Murkrow card. We got a Clefairy. We've got an Indy. We got a Purgly. We have a Fero. A Qfant. An Eevee. Love the artwork on that Eevee card. Very, very cool. We've got a double blade. We've got a power, a pornard, a mawilly, or mo. <laughs> We've got a mawil, a bronzo, a far fetched. And like I said, these are all in pristine condition. These cards from the second seller. We've got Chansey, a Pigonite, a Sizzlypede, another Sizzlypede, because when one's not enough. We've got a Charmander, again, still prefer the Wizards of the Coast artwork for this, but uh, it's still very cool nonetheless. We've got a Dotler, an Esper, a Grumpig, a Baltoy. A Spoink, an Ekans, that's cool, what the Ekans card, another Coffin, I've said so many Coffins today, and the last card is a Honchcrow GX, very, very cool, so we got two big hits out of this, we got a Dreadnought V and a Honchcrow GX, I love the new just artwork on these. We got the Honchcrow Full Art and the Dreadnought V. 
So we got two fire hits out of these today. I'm uh, going to be opening up some more modern booster packs in the next video. But uh, I'm very happy with uh, how this has started. Oh, it's got, got a little bit of damage. Is that on the card? Oh, that's no, just on the sleeve. Very cool. I'm very happy with uh, how this has turned out today. We've got the Haunch Crow GX Full Art card and a Dreadnought V. So this is my first, well, these are my first cards getting back into Pokemon. And it has been an amazing start to the journey. Thank you for sticking around until the end. I hope you enjoyed watching some of those absolutely awesome pulls from our first two mystery packs. I've got a new video coming up in a few weeks time, which should just be documenting a new opening that I'm gonna be doing. I've also got a Pokemon card coming from a competition that I've been very fortunate to win. I'm not gonna tell you what that card is just yet, but it's a very rare card, so it's definitely worth sticking around for. Take care, all people Pokemon, and I will see you in the next one.